Yes, we have a commitment to do that, he said when asked during a townal if the U.S. would defend Taiwan. But a White House spokesman later told some U.S. media outlets that his remarks did not signify a change in policy. The U.S. has long practiced strategic ambiguity when it comes to the thorny issue of defending Taiwan. This has meant the U.S. has been deliberately ambiguous about what it would do if China were to attack the island. China sees Taiwan as a breakaway province, one that it may take back by force one day if necessary, whereas Taiwan claims that it is a sovereign state. What you do have to worry about is whether or not they're China going to engage in activities that would put them in a position where they may make a serious mistake, he said. When queried a second time by CNN's Anderson's Cooper about whether the U.S. would come to Taiwan's defense in the event of an attack by China, Biden again answered in the affirmative. A White House spokesperson later attempted to clarify Biden's comments to U.S. media outlets, saying the U.S. was not announcing any change in our policy and there is no change in our policy.